my swine. It's another beautiful overcast day here at Beacon Flay, uh, but today we're heading out to Midmar Dam. We've got a charter organized uh, with SA Bass Fishing Tours, a guy called Tian, and uh, yeah, we're hoping to catch some bigger fish over there. Okay, so let's go. Looks like Tian has arrived. I think it's Tian. Hello, man. Yeah. How you guys doing? How's it going? You guys can jump one? To start off, we headed straight across the dam to where the fish had been biting recently. All count. Okay, Tian, so what are, we, what are we targeting here? Okay, so basically we're just fishing in amongst our driller, some grass in the water. And uh, what we're looking for at the moment is a nice big female that's moved up to spawn. Um, and yeah, basically, officially, we, we have been catching our little males that um, come mm -hmm. up and sort of prepared a nest and got ready for the females to come up and uh, spawn. So basically, we just need to weed through the, all of these little males and eventually we'll find a nice big female. So hopefully, by big I mean a nice 5 kg. Nice. Cool. That's the plan. Thanks. Cool. From here we travelled all the way west to a nice little bay where there was lots of structure. And once again Linky got the first bite, but we very quickly realised this was no ordinary fish. Oh my god. Let it jump too much. Oh, the size of this thing. Not coming in easily. Putting up a good fight. Take your thumb. Oh, 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 oh. 
I'm not gonna jump anymore, it's getting tight. This is the biggest bass I've ever seen. This is your PB. This is a monster. This is where it's... Four. Only four? Four kg. Tails broken. Thanks, smash bike. Job well done. One centimeter. Yeah. And then just support the belly up. Got it. Nice. Ready? Let's release this bad boy. As it turns out, it wasn't her PB after all. That honor still remains with this fish caught at Beacon Flay a couple of years ago. It was a close second though. From here we drifted all along the bank, catching some more nice males along the way. Every now and then, Tian would supply some handy tips. So basically, just a little tip for most of the bank anglers, also the guys on the boat. Fishing up close to the bank, it's a good time of year to be fishing along the color line. And by color line, I mean where the clear water meets the, the darker water, where you can't see the bottom anymore. Fish along that line, and the reason why I say that is often the bass will sit in the darker water um, and use that as an ambush point and shoot up into the shallow water to feed. So, fish that color line, guys. Awesome, thanks a lot.
Next up was another area that Tian thought could be productive. So we headed straight there. Our final spot was a little bit north from here and at this point the weather was starting to turn on us but the fish were biting so we kept on fishing. So after a few more, and with the weather really starting to get angry, we decided to head back. So thanks a lot, Tian. Yeah, it was brilliant. Fun. And uh, we got a new PB, perhaps. I don't know. At least one that we've weighed. Yeah. yeah. That was an excellent fish. Well done. Yeah. Great. How many fish did we end up with, you think? I think we ended up with about 50 or so. A lot of them. And uh, not too bad size either. So yeah. oh, overall, good day. Awesome. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Well, thanks again. And uh, yeah, I'll check you next time. Yeah. Be, be good to fish with you guys again. And, uh, all the best for the future. Thanks a lot, Tia. Cheers, man. And here's a quick summary of how we did at the spots we fished at. In terms of lures, one thing that we definitely learned about Midmore Dam on this trip is that worms work very well. And Linky caught almost all her fish on this worm from smash boats, including her giant. We also caught a few on dark flukes and swim baits, and Tian also caught a couple on a crankbait. So Tian is with SA Bass Fishing Tours, and besides Midmar, they also offer charters to all the popular dams in Atoll, including Albert Falls and Inanda. So a spectacular day out on Midmore Dam, we had an awesome time. Thank you Tian from SA Bass Fishing Tours, it was really great. Um, but we are back at Beacon Flay right now and we're getting ready for some top water action. So thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed the video and see you guys next time. Cheers.